Hi YouTube, Darren here, and today I wanted to discuss a Lucas distributor that I removed from a Mini after a recent tuning session. The uh, the owner was complaining about uh, hard starting and uh, lack of power, kind of at the low end, and um, I went out to investigate this car and to tune it, and I noticed something strange going on with the distributor. Um, <clears throat> when I went to check timing, I noticed it was about oh, 20 or so degrees all in, so uh, I adjusted it to about 30, and I noticed that uh, when I let the revs fall, the timing wouldn't drop past, say, 20 or 19 degrees. So uh, the car had too much advance at the low end, or not enough advance at the top end, one of the two. Um, either way, the owner and I decided to replace the distributor with a uh, recurve unit that I um, had from PowerSpark, and um, the car ran fine after that and was easy, easy to start. But what I wanted to do today was actually just take a look at this and see what was going on in here um, that was causing the uh, advanced curve to be so strange. So what I'm going to do is take off the uh, breaker plate and have a look down inside and see what's going on. Well, I've removed the distributor breaker plate to inspect what's going on with this, this distributor here. And I've noticed that uh, it only has one set of springs. The secondary spring is there, but the primary spring, which goes here, is uh, missing completely. Which would explain why we had such bad advanced characteristics in this distributor. Um, so what I'm going to do is I'm going to take this apart, clean it up, and check the overall characteristics of this advanced plate here. As well as check this spring, and then uh, find a suitable spring, or make a spring, to give the correct uh, primary advanced curve characteristics that we want. So. Uh, stay with me while I take this over to uh, get cleaned and inspect a few parts before I put on my distributor machine. Checking the distributor advance, we see that we have approximately 12 degrees, which is what is stamped on the cam, which is excellent. After cleaning, and polishing all of the parts, including the shaft itself. I then sourced a new spring for the primary here. Testing in the, my distributor machine proved that this will be well suited for the application, which in this case was a 850cc mini. Um, I will now assemble this and it'll be good to go. And here is the finished distributor, ready to go back into service. I did check the vacuum module here for uh, operation and it does perform as designed so I left it alone but I do have replacement units for these although this one is unique in that it has the thread type currently available replacement units only have the push-in style these days but uh, they work just as well so anyway if uh, you have any questions please uh, send a comment otherwise I'll uh, see you later in the next video